Good morning, Britain preparing to give the greatest a send-off to remember. Muhammad Ali's family have promised a funeral for the world this week in Kentucky, where the boxer's body arrived late last night. We'll be with Ross King in Louisville and Jonathan Swain reports in London. Well, good morning. All weekend, fans have been coming into this exhibition to pay tribute to the greatest. We'll look back at the legacy he left, not just here in the UK, but of course around the world as well. The Prime Minister will join forces with his political rivals today to accuse Boris Johnson of conning the public over the cost of leaving the EU as a Good Morning Britain poll puts the Leave campaign four points ahead. Swapping his cricket whites for chef's whites, Andrew Freddie Flintoff joins us to tell us about his latest adventures in an eco-friendly chip van. And he's off. Bad boy Ben Shepherd gets a red card for this terrible tackle on Edgar Davids, followed by an even worse one on Dimitar Berbatov during last night's soccer raid. It was all for a good cause, of course, raising half, uh, five and a half million pounds. But Ben, what were you thinking? <laughs> Monday, 6th of June, 2016. Live from ITV Studios in London. This is Good Morning Britain. Just after 7 o'clock, our main news this morning, the greatest send-off. Muhammad Ali's body has arrived back in his hometown. The boxing legend's casket was flown into Louisville last night and then driven from the airport in a motorcade. On Thursday, his family will hold a private funeral before a public service and procession the next day, which organisers say the entire world is invited to. Well, Ross King is there for us. Ross, must be pretty special being in Louisville right now.